Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to a new day. It is Thursday afternoon, uh, 3.15 in the afternoon to be exact. And I went to the weekly food pantry today and I'll do that haul. But I just wanted to show you a couple of the already made uh, lunches we got from there. Just because we're going to eat them right now for lunch. So there's some chicken tenders with barbecue sauce. And Glenn's going to have that. There's like three chicken tenders in there. And then here's some chicken loco tacos. So I'm going to try those. Uh, we're kind of hungry right now. So we're going to eat these for a uh, late lunch. And then I'll do the haul. So we actually got two packs of the chicken loco tacos. Uh, but Glenn doesn't like flour tortillas. So looks like I'll be eating those. All right. So we're going to have lunch. And then I'll do the haul. All right, everyone, so here is this week's food pantry haul. I went late today, so by the time I got there, uh, many of the sections were already emptied, and that's fine. But as you can see, I still got some good stuff, and I'll just start over here. Just got this three-pack of Danish. I took them out of the plastic bag because they were wet and sticky, so let them dry out. I'll cover it with tin foil so that they don't get like too hard. And we'll have those later on, and Glenn will have some coffee with that. So I got some Danish, and got some dinner rolls. These are the brown and serve. So I'll just throw those in the freezer whenever we want dinner rolls. We still were able to pick out three items of produce. A lot of the produce was gone already, but I still managed to come up with uh, four of the Roma tomatoes. And I got those because I chose a bag of garden salad. So we can cut up some tomatoes, throw them in that salad. And I did go to Piggly Wiggly today. So I picked up a cucumber to throw it in that salad as well. And while I was at Piggly Wiggly, I got that deal where you buy two boxes of waffles, Eggo waffles, two for $5 on sale. And then you can get a, a block of a old creamery butter for $1.49. So I got that deal. And back to the food pantry haul. Got a bag of grapes. Uh, we tasted them. Not a lot of flavor. A little bittery at the beginning, but not a lot of flavor afterwards. But that's okay. I'll wash them out and we'll eat them. And I'll save this for last. This was amazing. Got a bag of shredded mozzarella cheese. And I chose this for Glenn. Old El Paso chopped green chilies. So got that for him. And a can of beef stew. And we got a box of, uh, it's kind of like a hamburger helper. It's cheeseburger, cheeseburger macaroni or whatever. And of course, they are a week uh, gift of toilet paper. So um, this this being the the big thing this week, look, <laughs> look at these. These are pork steaks. There's two of them in there. They're huge. They are huge. And so it was a choice of this. Um, already made chicken breasts, not full chicken breasts, just patties, and then, uh, or bacon and eggs. So that, those eggs we got at, uh, Meyer in our last grocery haul, the two pack of 18. We haven't even dipped into that yet. So, um, I decided to go with the pork steaks. Those will be great on the grill. So that is our food pantry haul for the week. That is our weekly so, so yeah, still, even though I I went late and the sections were closed, some of the sections were emptied, we still got some good stuff. So still many blessings for us. Okay, so that is our pantry haul. All right, everyone. So I have a very small, uh, but not small in price, uh, grocery haul. It's a combination of pantry items uh, and snacks and junk food whatever. Everybody needs their junk food and snacks to get them through. So I'll just go over uh, quickly what we got. Um, you already saw the weekly food pantry haul. So this is a small grocery haul. And then in the next couple days, I'll have another food pantry haul. This would be a monthly one. So stay tuned for that one. I haven't gotten out to the freezer because it's been cold. But I will get out there. So, <laughs> all right. So let's get started. 
we have these Aju gravy mix packs. I like to keep these for uh, when we have French dip. And I do have French dip on the meal plan for this month. So, and these are so cheap versus McCormick's. McCormick's are like $2 a pack. These are 50 cents and I always get the Kroger brand. So I got four of those. So these are just for mainly stock up. I'll probably use one or so, maybe two at the most for a French dip. I don't know when we're having that, but that's mainly stock up. Got two cucumbers. Um, later on today, we're going to be making for Glenn his cucumber spread where he does the soft rye bread and has the cucumber spread and then uh, puts cucumbers on top of it with dill, dill weed. So we're going to be making that today, but that'll be on another video. So, and I got two of them also. One, he usually has that like a couple days in a row. And I do have another cucumber, so we can also have a salad. So we did get a garden salad bag from the pantry, so we can have a salad as well. So that, got a pack of semi-sweet chocolate chips. And that's more for... Uh, like a ganache frosting. Uh, at some point I'll make a, a banana banana flavored eclair tort. So I use semi-sweet for the ganache frosting on top. So that's for that. I do have milk chocolate chips, but I don't have any more semi-sweet and I need those for that. Um, got a big pack of marshmallows. Where I think we're out of marshmallows for hot chocolate. And then I also might, I have a couple of boxes of our a generic, off-brand, generic brand of Rice Krispies from the pantry. So I think I might make some Rice Krispie treats. So I'll use some of those marshmallows. And then got a loaf of classic white bread. I love this bread from Kroger. It's always so soft and it lasts a long time with staying soft. Um, there was some good sales. A lot of this was good sales. I had digital coupons, paper coupons that Kroger sent to me. And they have that ad sale where if you buy six particular items, you get a certain amount off each item. So uh, the bread ended up being real cheap with all those sales and coupons. Also got two packs of hamburger buns from Kroger. Um, also sale item, coupon item. I got two packs because tonight I'm going to make uh, hot tamales, but that again will probably just be on the weekend meal video. So I got two packs of that. I got three boxes of this Lipton onion soup mix. I haven't had this in the house in a while, but that stuff is good to put in like your pot roast and things like that. So it was on sale, so I got three boxes. I think it's ended up same, saving like one or two dollars. And then got the soft rye bread. He likes the beefsteak brand. This is for his cucumber spread that we'll be making in a little bit. We're just waiting for the cream cheese to soften. So we'll be making that later on today. And again, that'll be on the weekend mail video. Got a box of uh, popcorn butter flavor. We don't get this too often. But sometimes uh, you just like to have a bag of popcorn, I guess. <laughs> Got a box of these uh, ranch dip. Sorry about the glare. I have the the flash on the camera, which is the phone, and it gives that glare. So sorry about that. Um, there's five of them in there. No. I don't know how many are in there. Oh, <laughs> I'm covering it up for the... <laughs> so four. That's going to be a part of that uh, mix for Glenn's uh, thing. And I got a head of lettuce. We, if you recall in the food pantry video, uh, the weekly, we got some Roma tomatoes. So with that lettuce, we got some bacon in the refrigerator. We can make some BLTs for lunch this week. And then got Glenn a can of his jalapeno cheddar cheese. So he likes to have this cheese when I make them like hot ham and cheese sandwiches. He likes to have this cheese on there rather than sliced cheese. So, and we're using, we would use the ham we got from the spiral ham that we received from the pantry. I, I tore all that apart and froze it in a bunch of small packs. So that's that. And 
This is something new I got for Glenn today. It's from Haluva Good Dip and Jalapeno Cheddar flavor. He's already dug into it because he always has to know how it tastes right away. He definitely recommends this if you like like a not too strong of a spice but still has enough in it to uh, taste good. He definitely recommends this. He, he thought it was delicious. So this is, I'll show you what it looks like. And it's got all those different jalapenos in there. So he really liked it. So he recommends this if you like spice. So again, this is Haluva Good Dip Jalapeno Cheddar. And next time I get him some, uh, he wants to try the bacon horseradish. So yeah, definitely a recommendation from Glenn. And then for me, <laughs> I got the French onion dip. So, <laughs> and I got myself a jar of goober grape. I used to eat this all the time when I was working my traditional job. I used to take this uh, goober grape sandwich. It's basically grape jelly and peanut butter in the same jar. I absolutely love this stuff, but I haven't bought this stuff in such a long time. Um, just because I didn't want to spend the money on it, I guess. But every now and then you got to do that. So I got that for myself. Glenn doesn't really eat that. Uh, got a, I don't know if you can see back here. Got a bag of wavy Lay's wavy potato chips. They're kind of like ruffles. Um, and that's for the dip. And got this jug of Snapple Mango Madness. Now... Last week, not this pantry that, not the pantry haul you, you saw in today's video, but the one last or the week before, one of them, we got a, a bottle of Snapple Fruit Punch, and it was pretty good, and we both stated how we both used to drink Snapple, but it is a little expensive, so, and I used to drink mango, and so did he, but we weren't together at that time, um, just one of those things we had in common, I guess. Um, so we thought we'd try it again. So, got that. Uh, candy bars. They were buy two, get one free. So we got two Kit Kats and a Reese cup. I eat the Reese cup. Glenn got the Kit Kat and we'll split the third one. Uh, got some flour tortillas and corn tortillas. We went through our last batches of tortillas fairly quick. Uh, with making the breakfasts and the quesadillas and the tacos, soft tacos and things like that. So, and then last, got a pack of, these were some of the sale items and coupon items. Uh, double stuff Oreo. And then, and I thought to make, well I, I like to dip them in milk, but I also want to make some fried Oreos. And we also like the mint Oreos. We got some of those so these are some of the things that are the snacks um just got to take us to next month well well into next month so that's our snacks for the month all right so that's our small grocery haul and you already saw the weekly food pantry and again a reminder um i'll have that monthly food pantry haul coming up so if you haven't subscribed Please subscribe if you like the videos, uh, grocery hauls, food pantry hauls, cooking, and all that stuff. Um, definitely subscribe. It doesn't cost you anything. And hit the notification bell so you'll be reminded when I put out a video. Hit that like button and share it with your friends who might enjoy these videos as well. All right. And a reminder, if you haven't gone over to my second channel, Wisconsin Backyard Birding, I'll be posting a video on there as well today. And I started doing shorts videos. And I also thought to do shorts videos on this channel with maybe some of the cooking videos or grocery hauls or things like that. We'll see. All right. So that's going to be it for now. I hope you enjoyed this video. I will get out to the freezer and get that done. So with that, remember to live life, be good to yourself, and be good to others. Until next time.